hello everyone the today video is about url versus route so why route is best so let's understand it with the example so i'm creating a new route here so this should be a get route and this route name is test and i am doing this through closure and do let me put the bracket sign and remember you need to comment this route because we already implemented this test route so it's not going to execute this test route it will execute this one right so you need to comment out this so let me return some view here and uh, first we need to create a view here right so let's go here and in the post i want to create a test route right test dot play dot php and i created this so let me add some basic stuff and add a button here so button should be uh, contact us contact us save this one go to this browser and uh, open this here post test and uh, let me open this out there so it should be uh, test hit refresh and yes now contact us is there so let me create uh, another route so it should be also a get and this should be a contact uh, contact us and this will be also clue here and uh, paste it here and let me return something contact us page right now we are on landing on this uh, post dot test and there is a uh, on the post dot test let's click on this and we have this contact us button so i want to uh, go to the contact us route which we define here right so there is two ways the uh, first understand that how we can go to this route with the hard coding the url so let me go to this contact us i think name is contact us yes contact us so i type this in the href contact us and uh, give it refresh and uh, yes now it's going on this contact us let's uh, take an eye on the left bottom let's click on this and yes now it's going on this contact us page right but i want to put here a dynamic url right so i don't want to uh, follow this static because our if our page contain uh, more than 100 or 50 so it will create problem when we want to change some route so it's very uh, a very uh, bad practice to put to a static url so that's why we are suggesting to put a dynamic url so two ways we can put that dynamic url the first one is url right and we need to manually go to this file and copy this url right and uh, paste it here right give it refresh and uh, it's also generating contact us so let's click on this and yes now we are on this contact us page so it means that our url is also url method is also working so why we use this uh, through this uh, route name so let's go here and name this right so name and this should be a contact and uh, how can i call this uh, route name so let's remove this one and type route and route should be contact so my text teacher is suggesting me this will be a contact we define it here right so save this one and give it refresh let's click on this and it's also uh, going to this contact us page so what is the major difference between this uh, url and route first now now understand it so let's put it again using this url okay it should be uh, contact us right so it's working great so it's working going on the contact us page so let's uh, let's go to this uh, web.php file and i want to make this administrator contact us so i want to type this admin slash contact us right so let's give it refresh and uh, let's click on this so now it says that contact us not found why it's not found because uh, this path is changed 
so our url method is not working so let's go here and we need to manually put here admin slash contact us so then it's going to work so let me give it refresh and click on this and yes now it's working so it means that if we have multiple like 1000 or 100 button so we need to manually go to the each button and change their stuff right but if we want to if we use this contact name right in this route name so this will be very easy we don't need to mention Erwin anything so let's remove this url and type route and route name will be contact right we don't need to put here admin slash contact us so let me go there and remove this contact us first and that it's working or not so let's click on this and we are on the contact us page so it means that it's working so if i want to change this admin slash post slash contact us so give it refresh and click on this so it's also working how it's working so when we type this name so this name is convert uh, getting this url and uh, uh, redirecting us on the our intended page so that is the beauty of uh, uh, using uh, route so if you use uh, like uh, admin slash post you don't need to change anything in the in your button or stuff like that so it will automatically uh, checking that with what is the url of your route so that is the beauty of uh, this uh, route so hopefully you understood this uh, step and if you have any question you can ask me in the comments box